Hi, I was having some problems with my Arians Rocket 5 Rototiller, and so I decided that I was going to take the engine off. So this is the original equipment engine that came with it, and put a new one on, actually a new used engine. And um, so this one was having some trouble starting, and so I want to I want to like work it over a little bit and get it all squared away, and then put it on the rototiller eventually. Um, this engine here, uh, the new ones are kind of expensive, but I was at a flea market and a guy had this for $20, so I bought it. Now, here's the thing, if, you, if you're going to switch these engines, uh, I lost something in this transfer because if you look at the original engine, come over here, there's an extra drive shaft here. This is the main drive shaft here. But this is an extra drive shaft. This is a, an engine sheave that sits on that shaft. But this is your reverse. So if you're if you're looking at one of these engines, these are the uh, Tecumseh vertical engines. You need to if you want reverse, you have to have this shaft coming out of the engine. So look over on this one here. This one doesn't have the shaft. It's missing. So. This will run everything except I won't have any reverse. So right there there would be a shaft coming out and then you put that engine sheave on. So I got this one for for uh, you know twenty dollars and it's worth putting it on. I'm gonna I'm gonna just start it up here or attempt to start it up and run it a little bit without reverse. I'm used to having reverse and I hope to get this one fixed up and back on there so it'll be all original equipment. But this one for twenty dollars is worth a worth a try. So we're gonna see how she runs with the new engine. Okay, so gotta let the gas flow here. That's a little different than the other one. I think it chokes about where I want it. Make sure it's Nothing's in drive, neutral, put that forward. Hope it works.
shut that off. Well, as you can see, it runs pretty good. I mean, that was really easy tilling, and this ground was kind of hard. It's the first that's been touched this year because I'm behind in my gardening. Um, and, you know, I kind of I kind of missed the reverse that comes from that, but it wasn't that bad. So honestly, the engine ran pretty good for $20. That was I think that that was a worthwhile endeavor. Um, and if I get this thing fixed up, I might switch it back on, so I'll have an original equipment. So anyway, so this is the Arians Rocket 5 Rototiller. It's a 1970s model. I bought this probably 15 years ago at an auction for, I think I paid $125 for it. I've used it ever since. Last year, it started to give me some trouble, and so um, put, the, put the new engine on it, and I think it'll be okay without the reverse, but if you're, if you're looking for an engine, um, I would check that out. If you want reverse, you've got to have that drive, or else you're just going to have, have like this one is here, which, which is fine. Uh, I think I'll have no problems using it. Well, that, that's the update on the Arians Rocket 5 Tiller. If you want to see it running with the old engine, um, I have a video on the channel with that also. Talk to you later.